So I will introduce the next person's voice that you will hear will be Pastor Sherry Weathersby. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Be the glory to God, be the glory for the things he has done with his blood. He has saved me with his power, thank God, he raised to God be the glory for the things he has already done. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. We ought to shout right there. <laughs> Hallelujah. Father, we thank you and we give you glory and honor and praise. Praise God to you. Be glory now, God. All the honor. Amen and amen. Amen. We give God, glory, honor, and praise. We thank God for this beautiful church, my new family. Amen. I'm a, I'm a newbie. Amen. It's all right being a newbie. Hallelujah. Ain't nothing wrong with it. Long God is with us. And long as he's in us, and I honor my pastors, Pastor Phil and, and Sylvia Davenport. Amen. And all the pastors and, and evangelists and everybody. Just the body of Christ. Amen. Praise God. God is a good God and we won't tarry because we know we have, praise God, someone else coming alongside of us. Amen. Praise God. So we just thank God for this opportunity. Hallelujah. To be able just to be a small witness for the Lord. Amen. Praise God. Probably nothing you haven't, we haven't already heard. Amen. But it's nothing wrong with being refreshed. Hallelujah. We don't want to get so high that we can't be reminded. Amen. Praise God. So we don't forget because sometimes I forget. You know that song that says, Jesus, I'll never forget. Praise God. Well, we can't say that. Just Lord Jesus, help me not to forget what you've done for me. Amen. And I thank God I was listening to this little baby. Praise God. That was praising the Lord. Praise God. Hallelujah. God has already done a new thing down in that little child's heart. Her voice was sounding above the everything. <laughs> Hallelujah. Praise God. The children shall lead us, won't they? Praise God. We're not so high that we can't be led. Amen. And that really encouraged my heart to hear the sound. Praise God. Hallelujah. Something's going on down on the inside. Oh, yes. Yeah. She's been brought up well. Amen. Praise God. And that's just the same way with us. When we've been brought up well, there's a sound that comes out. Amen. And that sound is the praises of God. Amen. Praise God. So we're just going to touch a little bit, praise God, on what the Lord is, has given in part. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. He is and has already done a new thing. Praise God. We are here as evidence. We are here as witnesses of what God has done in our life. Amen. And let's look at Isaiah 43 and 10. Well, let's start at the 16th verse. Isaiah 43. 16 amplified this is what the lord says he who makes a way through the sea and a path through the mighty waters he who brings out the chariot and the horse the army and the mighty warrior they lay down together they will not rise again they have been extinguished they have been put out like a lamp's wick do not remember the former things amen or ponder the things of the past. Listen carefully to 19 verses. I'm about to do a new thing. Now it will spring forth. When I heard that sound, praise God, I, I, it, it was the springing forth. Praise God, hallelujah. It was coming up out of that little baby. Amen. Praise God, hallelujah. Now it will spring forth. Will you not be aware of it? Amen. I will even put a road in the wilderness, rivers in the desert, 
the beasts of the field, they're going to honor me. Now, isn't that powerful? The beasts of the field honors God, the jackals and the ostriches, because he gave waters in the wilderness and rivers in the desert to give drink to my people, my chosen. 21st verse, the people whom I formed for myself. Amen. Y'all throw a, 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 a handkerchief up or something when my time is up. <laughs> All right, please, somebody work with me. <laughs> Amen. 21st verse, the people whom I formed for myself, praise God, will make known my praise. Amen. Behold, behold, I do a new thing. And this is what it's all about, that we will make known the praises of him who had brought us out of darkness into this marvelous light. Amen. There are many in the Bible of Christ today still haven't got a hold of that they've been made anew from the inside. Amen. Praise God. Because when it's time to show forth that newness, this is what God did for us. Amen. Praise God. We can forgive now before we couldn't forgive. Hallelujah. That's new to some of us. <laughs> that was new to me. Hallelujah. You mean to tell me after all this pain, I still got to forgive you. Amen. But there is a well of water down on the inside of us, y'all. Hallelujah. Praise God. Spring it up and to eternal life. Amen. The Lord delivered Israel. The deliverance of Israel showed that he was the true God, their Savior. There go Jesus. Amen. And no one can oppose his plans in our life. What God, hallelujah, did, it couldn't be duplicated. By no other strange God, no other foreign God, amen, Israel's existence proved, praise God, or witnesses to his sovereignty and eternity, amen, praise God. And we are here today, amen, as men and women of God, amen, praise God, with the proof, praise God, down on the inside, hallelujah, that something has happened. A change, a change has not only come over us, but a change happened inside of us. And could nobody do this but God? There's, a, there's an old song, praise God, I hope nobody get offended. I, I, sometime I go way back and say, I, I, I never knew love before till came you. Amen, praise God. I never knew this kind of love. Praise God, hallelujah, until I met and I'm still learning. It ain't got nothing to do with the titles and all that. I'm still learning. We're still learning about this God. We're still learning about this love. We're still learning about this well of water that we have down on the inside of us. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. So Israel was to show forth the praises of God. They were to be the witnesses, just like we're to be the witnesses of God. No one can reverse what God has done. Isn't that powerful? Praise God. Hallelujah. They can do all kinds of things to us, but what God did for us on the inside, praise God, can't nobody change, can't nobody reverse. Amen. Because what he did, he did because he's God. Hallelujah. All by himself. Amen. Praise God. So no one can reverse it. Praise God. Because it's already been done. Praise God. He already told us that he knew the plans that he had for us. Amen. Praise God. It was an appointed time that each and every one of us, praise God, hallelujah, would receive Jesus Christ as, praise God, our personal Savior. Amen. We didn't think that could be either. Praise God. You mean to tell me, praise God, I can come forth, praise God, and, and accept Jesus Christ with all my baggage, praise God, with everything that I've done? That's why he said, wait a minute now, wait a minute. Praise God. Behold, now look at this thing. Watch me. Watch me. Praise God. Hallelujah. I'm doing a new thing. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. You know what people see us and they say, I remember you when. Hallelujah. That's when. That was when. Amen. Praise God. But hallelujah. Praise God. Something else done happened since when. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. It ain't about being religious about it or coming on a Saturday morning and, you know, getting it all together. Uh-uh. This thing is a daily realization. It's a daily walk, a daily realization. No matter what we go through, no matter what happens, no matter who come, no matter who go, no matter, no matter, no matter. It doesn't even matter how, as long as we know this is a personal thing. It's corporate, but it's personal. Praise God. How he's an intentional God. He's a corporate God, but we know he's also a personal God. Hallelujah. He came personally to me one day. Amen. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, he did. Hallelujah. I'm glad about it. 
It brings tears to my eyes sometimes. Praise God. Hallelujah. Because when I look in the mirror, praise God, I don't see the old Sherry anymore. See, you got to see this thing with the eyes of the spirit. With that spirit down on the inside, praise God. And it took us a long time to get here, and we still got a long way to go. But where I am right now, I thank God for it. That's why I say to God be the glory. That's new to me. Hallelujah. We 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 worry about sometimes new shoes and new dresses and and, and and new weaves and wigs and new hairdos and and you know Gucci's, Gucci's and Gucci's, all those things. There ain't nothing wrong with it. Look good like a child of God should. Ain't nothing wrong with that. Amen. Amen. But oh, that wears with the using, don't it? Oh yeah, do it tires out, y'all. Hallelujah. It molds, it corrupts, but down on the inside. Mm -hmm. That's where the proof is in the pudding. Amen. So he brought them out. He brought them out of Egypt. Praise God. He drowned the Egyptian army, didn't he? Yes, he did. Praise God. Hallelujah. God, hallelujah, said, but hey, forget about all that. I'm getting ready to do something else. Hallelujah. I'm getting ready to do something else in your life. Amen. Praise God. He brought them through some desert lands, y'all. Praise God, where God, hallelujah, provided streams hallelujah, and waters in abundance. Yes, he did. Hallelujah. Therefore, he, hallelujah, he chose them, praise God, like he chose you and I, that we would praise him. Praise God, that we will manifest that thing. Praise God. Hallelujah. That new thing. That's what the word of God lets us know uh, in 2 Corinthians, I believe I wrote it down, yeah, 517. Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, the Messiah, the anointed one that is engrafted and joined to him by faith in him as savior. He is a new creature. Amen. Behold, behold, I did this thing. Ain't nothing about what we could do. It's not about works. Let's anybody going to boast. Amen. Praise God. There's power in the house this morning, y'all. Hallelujah. Praise God. Anytime the sons of sons of God get together, come on. Hallelujah. There's power here. Praise God. Because God is still doing things. Hallelujah. He saved us, but he wants to do things through us as well and go out and begin to express the love of God to some dying soul. Praise God. That need to know. Hallelujah. Praise God that he is real. Oh, yes, he's real. That song said, I know he's real down in my soul. Amen. He washed me. He made me whole. Oh, yes, he did. Hallelujah. Praise God. God is real. And it goes on to say, praise God, as a new creature, reborn and renewed by the Holy Spirit. Old things, the previous what? Moral and spiritual condition. We can let it all go, right? Amen. We don't have to embrace it. We don't have to allow it to embrace us. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. That old spiritual condition had passed away. Behold, take a look at this thing now. Take another good look at Jesus. Hallelujah. Sometimes we just need another look. Praise God. Hallelujah. Of who he is. Not only what he can do and what he done, but just who he is. Hallelujah. He's Jehovah Jireh, our provider. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. Jehovah Nisi. He reigns in victory. Yes, he does. Hallelujah. He's Jehovah Rapha. If you need a healing this morning, he's here. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. That might sound old to somebody, but we're going to keep on saying it. Praise God till it become new within our own heart, mind, soul, and spirit. He's still a healer. He's still a deliverer. He's still a way maker. Hallelujah. He is still God. Hallelujah. And he will always be God. Hallelujah. From eternity to eternity, thou art God. Hallelujah. Praise God. It's good to be saved. It feels good to be saved, y'all. It feels good to know that you're saved. Set aside by the Holy Spirit. Hallelujah. Somebody like me. Praise God out the streets. Hallelujah. Whoremonging. Hallelujah. That's why I'm happy today. It ain't that I'm up here. <laughs> hallelujah. Praise God. But when I think, hallelujah, where he brought me from. Hallelujah. Praise God. They called me the black stallion. Don't go there. Amen. Yes, they did. I don't mind telling them a testimony because he changed me. He did something. He did something new, y'all. I was riding a mighty high out there. 
Hallelujah. Drinking and snorting and doing all this. Praise God. Drugging. Hallelujah. Oh, yes, I was. Hallelujah. We don't come up here as if, praise God, we got it all together. Uh, that we didn't come from somewhere. Amen. Why would he say forget if we didn't come from somewhere? Hallelujah. Praise God. But he seen fit. I'm just testifying me. I don't bother nobody because I don't know y'all. Hallelujah. But I just stay, stay with me. Amen. He took me and he made something beautiful out of my life. Praise God. That's why I love this thing. Praise God. Hallelujah. Behold, behold, take another look. I did a new thing. Praise God. Hallelujah. And he's bringing about changes every day in our lives. He's doing some great things. Yes, he is. Hallelujah. In our lives, with our lives. Praise God. He's making ways out of no way. Hallelujah. Does that mean we don't have trials, tests, and tribulations? No, it don't. Praise God. We still have adversities. Amen. But we got a new way of handling it, don't we? I said we got a new way of handling it, don't we? I said we got a new perspective, don't we? On how to handle it. Whether you're with people, whether you're without people, praise God. As long as you know who's with you. Because greater is he that's in us right than he that is in the world and so he goes on to say behold new things have come praise god because spiritual awakening spiritual awakening brings new life hallelujah praise god hallelujah we need to wake up hallelujah new beginnings new experiences in christ praise god new way of walking new way of talking hallelujah praise god new opportunities Amen. All things have become new. Amen. In him. And we can endure these adversities because of Christ down on the inside of us. Amen. I'm reminded of the woman at the well. Amen. Praise God. I love that story. Praise God. Hallelujah. Because one day I was seeking. Praise God. I don't know if anybody can relate. Amen. For things that could not satisfy. Lord, have mercy. Hallelujah. Praise God. And the song just goes, like the woman at the well, I was sinking for things I could not, that could not satisfy. But I heard my Savior, he was speaking. He said, Sherry, draw from the well that never that never run dry fill my cup lord i when somebody lifted up i lifted up lord come and quench if you're thirsty if anybody is thirsty anybody on the line i don't know if we on facebook or whatever how is thirsty hallelujah but god is here to quench your thirst Come and quench this thirsting, this drying of my soul, bread of heaven. See, when you got a need, you don't care who's around you. Hallelujah. Praise. We just can't be a sit down, look and listen church. Hallelujah. If you got a need this morning, hallelujah, bread of heaven, cry out to him. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We ain't got it all together. Hallelujah. Feed me, Jesus, till I want no more. Fill my cup. Fill it up. Fill it up. Fill it up. How many need to fill it up? Oh, he, he, he made us new, but we still need another good drink sometimes. Because of the trials, tests, and tribulations, we need another good drink. Fill it up and make me whole. Mm -hmm. John 4, praise God. John 4 and 10 said, Jesus answered her, if you knew, if you knew about the gift, if you knew God's gift of eternal life, hallelujah, and who it is who says, give me drink. If we only knew, and when we know, that's why, hallelujah, we should be able to go out and tell somebody, Hallelujah about this Jesus. Hallelujah, praise God. Give me drink. You would have asked him instead, and he would have given you living water. Eternal life. Everything we've gone through, everything we're in right now, hallelujah, is leading somewhere. 
Hallelujah. It's leading. Hallelujah. Praise God to our destiny. Yes, it is. Hallelujah. However hard or long it is, it's leading somewhere. Amen. Our pastor told us, hallelujah, reminded us by the Holy Ghost. He ain't concerned about my history, but he is concerned about my destiny. Amen. Hallelujah. The one that saved me. Hallelujah. The one that filled me. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. And it goes on to say in John 11, Jesus said to him, she said to him, sir, you have nothing to draw with. No bucket. No rope. The well is deep. Amen. Hallelujah. Where then do you get that living water? Praise God. That was Jacob's well. She was dealing with the water from the well. Hallelujah. Praise God. But there was another water she's getting ready to experience. Praise God. Hallelujah. Because see, the natural well, praise God, it takes some work. Hallelujah. Praise God to get that water. Hallelujah. You can be thirsty. Hallelujah. But that water in that well was deep. Hallelujah. Praise God. But as it says here in the 12th verse, are you greater than hallelujah, your, our father Jacob? Who gave us the way? Well, ain't it good to know who he is? It's good to know who he is. It's good to recognize who he is. And who used to, and are you greater than your father, Jacob, who gave us the well and who used to drink from it himself and his sons and his cattle also? And Jesus answered her, everyone who drinks this water, hallelujah, will be thirsty again. You know how it is. We need food and water to sustain the, hallelujah, the physical body. Amen. Praise God. But there is a water. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Representing the Holy Spirit. 14 verse. But whoever drinks that water that I give, amen, will never thirst again. Hallelujah. Always satisfying. Always satisfying, y'all. Always satisfying. Amen. Ever running. Hallelujah. Over and abundant. Amen. Praise God. But the water that I give him will become in him. Jesus said a spring of water satisfying his thirst. There's so many thirsty people out here today. Amen. And, and there are many thirsty people even in the house of God. Amen. Praise God. Maybe we lost our sight on God. Hallelujah. Praise God. But every day is another opportunity to rise. Hallelujah. Every day we are given. Hallelujah. is a new beginning. It's a fresh start. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. This water is satisfying his thirst for God, welling up continually, is overflowing, is bubbling within him to eternal life. Praise God. And she says, sir, give me this water. Give me this water. Hallelujah. And God was willing to give. Give me this water. She wanted to forget her pain. She wanted to forget the things she had come to. The thing that she had been in. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. But she needed, hallelujah, more than just to be relieved from her problems. Amen. Just like us. We need more than just to be relieved of our problem. We need Jesus. We need Jesus. Hallelujah. Praise God. So therefore, because, praise God, hallelujah, we have Christ. Amen. Praise God. In our life, amen, we can come boldly to the throne of grace. Isn't that powerful? Amen. We don't have to ask nobody's permission. We ain't got to ask nobody's approval. Amen. We don't need nobody's applause. Amen. We can go straight to the throne. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Praise God. To the throne of grace. Yes, we can. Hallelujah. Ain't got to go through no middle man. Praise God. Ain't got to worry about who like it or who don't like it. Praise God. Because when we know who we are in him and who he is in us. Amen. We can stand tall in him. Praise God. Because greater is he that's in us than he that is in the world. Amen. Praise God. Christ made it so for us. We have that privilege to approach the throne of grace with confidence without fear because he did not give us when we full of God when we full of the spirit hallelujah there fear can't even get in there unless we just open the door and let it come in or something hallelujah praise God but when you're full pray what else can get in I mean when you're full and when we know we're full Hallelujah, praise God, without fear, so that we may receive mercy, praise God, for our failures and find his amazing grace. Praise God, Hebrews 4, 16, amen, to help in the time of need, hallelujah, an appropriate blessing coming just at the right time. Jesus came just at the right time. He came in the nick of time 
Just when the devil said, I'm going to kill her. Hallelujah. Praise God. He's still running his mouth. Amen. He's mad now because we ain't no longer talking to him. Amen. He's mad because we can go to the throne of grace. Because he used to be my daddy. I don't know about nobody out here. Hey, Amen. But he used to be my daddy. And I did everything my daddy told me to do. Yes, I did. Oh, yes, I did. Hallelujah. But I'm so glad. Hallelujah for our Father. Oh, my God. How aren't you glad about it? Hallelujah. Praise God. How are we witnessing Christ this morning? Hallelujah. Witnessing Jesus. Hallelujah. It makes us think. Hallelujah. It makes us think and reminisce on just who he is. And what we had, praise God, not just to run up and down the aisles and have goosebumps going down our arm, praise God. But this is an empowerment, praise God, hallelujah, to be able to live the life he called for us to live, praise God, and do the things that he called us to do. Amen. Because everybody has got a purpose. We're just not here. We have purpose. And what he did for us, making us anew, praise God, preparing us, praise God, for that which is ahead of us. Amen. Praise God to glorify and to praise his holy name. Amen. We got access, y'all. Amen. We got access. Isn't that all right? They can shut us down. People can shut you down in your own home, on your own jobs. Hallelujah. But praise God, we got access. Hallelujah. In this grace. Oh, yes, we do. We got access. Amen. Praise God. We can approach. We got permission. We got liberty. Hallelujah. In Christ. Yes, we do. Ain't nothing wrong with being reminded of it. I know it's small, but hey, hallelujah. We got liberty because sometimes we forget. I got liberty. You can shut me down, but I got liberty. Hallelujah. He did that for us. He did that thing down inside of us. Oh, yes, he did. We got access to be able to go and get what we need. To who we need to get it from. Ain't that powerful? Amen. If you li 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 need love, praise God, and, and you're not getting it, praise God, from people that you think you should be getting from. Hallelujah. The Lord is our shepherd, and we shall not want. Hallelujah. We can go to the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords and get everything that we need. Isn't that all right? Amen. So he says, behold, behold, take another look at this thing. Observe this thing. Praise God. Watch God. Watch God. Hallelujah. Watch God. Hallelujah. Amen. Because whatever he said, hallelujah, in our lives, he's able to fulfill it. Because he said, I'm not a man. That I should repent. That's what he said. Amen. Hey, hallelujah. That's in the amplifier. As he said, and he will not, will he not do it? Praise God. Or has he not spoken? And will he not make it good? Otherwise, won't he fulfill it? Did he fulfill it? Oh, yes, he did. Actually, it's already done. Already done. We're just learning through the power of the Holy Ghost to how to walk in the already. Hallelujah. Already. Isn't that powerful? Now, the carnal mind can't get that. Amen. The carnal mind can't get that. That's why we got to stay at the carnal mind. Praise God. And continue to allow our minds. Praise God. Where the handkerchief. Hallelujah. To praise God. Renew our minds daily. In the word of God, be refreshed again, hallelujah, so we don't forget. Amen. Praise God. Because he said, All power, all power, all power, all power. That means all power. We ain't worrying about all these other powers out here, right? Hallelujah. Praise God. Whatever's going on in our homes, in our lives, in our marriages, whatever, with the children. Praise God. God said, All power. Because he's doing something with them, praise God. While we approaching Christ, praise God, through praise and prayer and the word, he's doing something for our children. He's working something new. When we may not always see it, but he's turning some things around. It's turning in our favor. Yes, it is. We just got to believe it, y'all. And we got to keep encouraging one another. Don't be proud. But my title don't mean nothing when I have a need. Hallelujah. I can go to my sister. Now, I don't know this sister in the natural, but I know her by the spirit. And I know right now, if I went to her, hallelujah, hallelujah, and asked her to pray for me, I believe something will happen. Oh, yes, hallelujah. But God just don't do nothing for nothing. We're just not even here for nothing. No, we're not. He's doing some things. He's strengthening. Hallelujah. Because while we move it, he takes care of that husband. He takes care of that wife. He's moving on the job. Hallelujah. He's causing people to change their heart and mind about us right now. 
but we can't see that. But if we live in the beyond, if we live, praise God, beyond the natural, beyond what we see and go with what God knows. God knows. He is working it out. That's why we can, hallelujah, praise him in the time of sorrow. Amen. Though tears sometimes come down my face, but don't get it twisted. Hallelujah. Praise God. I know in whom I believe. Praise God. Hallelujah. And he is able. He's willing and he's able to do. Amen. Anything exceeding abundantly above all that we can ask or think. Yes, he can. Yes, he can. How he's God. He said, I'll bring it to pass. And not a devil in hell. Amen. Not a devil in hell. No thing, no man, no woman, no boy, no girl can stop it. Amen. Hallelujah. He, when he did this thing, he did it good. Oh, yes, he did. Hallelujah. God would do things we ain't never seen before. Oh, yeah. He going to do some more things we ain't never seen before. Hallelujah. I'm estranged from a couple of things in, in my home and family. Praise God. But look at God. Hallelujah. God said, keep moving. Keep watching me. Keep watching me. Stay with me. You got strength. You got power. How you got all? How you got some water? Hallelujah. We got water, y'all. This ain't stale water either. Hallelujah. This is running water. Hallelujah. Yes, Lord. Refreshing. Always refreshing. Refreshing our mind. Refreshing our attitude. Refreshing our will. Refreshing our intellect, our emotions. He's continuously refreshing us. But he said, you got to keep moving forward. Stay fixed, stay firm, stay focused, and keep it moving. Because we can do all things through Christ. It's just not quoting scripture and hearing it over and over and over again, over and over and over again, and not allowing it to have its effect in our life. Oh, yes, hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah, because while he taking care of that, Hallelujah, there's somebody else out there. Hallelujah, praise God, they need some water. Hallelujah, they need, hallelujah. Praise God for us to, hallelujah, be a witness for the Lord. Amen, praise God. Things we haven't encountered. Praise God, even the impossible becomes possible. Hallelujah, because look at me. Look at you. Somebody said it wouldn't be. Hallelujah, can she, is she, will she? Hallelujah. Praise God. Will it happen? I know they didn't. She didn't get saved. And you ain't got to know. Hallelujah. As long as we know. Hallelujah. You ain't got to know. Hallelujah. Praise God. Because it's good to have your own personal experience. Hallelujah. I know somebody told me about him. But when they told me about him, I said, God, show me your hand. Show me your face, Lord. Show me you, God. Open up my eyes that I may behold you in all your glory. In the spirit now, in the spirit, hallelujah, we can behold him, our Savior and Lord. This is a powerful walk. This is a powerful life. Yes, it is. It's more powerful than some of us would allow it to be. It's powerful in God. So powerful that it was able to save in spite of myself. It only took a few seconds for me to receive him as my personal savior. And we did that. You and I did that by faith, right? It took faith to believe. But why is it taking six months to get a breakthrough when it took a few seconds by faith to receive salvation? Something wrong with that picture. Something's wrong with that, y'all. Oh, he working with me. He working with me while I'm talking. Holla, I ain't got no pride in this thing. Hey, hallelujah. Ain't got no pride. Ain't no time for pride. Hallelujah, because we dealing with an enemy, y'all. We in warfare. Yes, we are. Hallelujah. Spiritual warfare. Not against one another. Hallelujah. We, the Bible says it all the time. But somehow or another, we still get a problem with Sister Kim. Still got a problem with Pastor Sylvia. Always a problem. I don't like what they got on. I don't like this. I don't like that. And that's not why he gave us power. That's not why he made us over again. Hallelujah. That ain't why. 
we're supposed to go forth and exuberate this power to somebody else. He said, if you lay hands on the sick, they're going to recover. Come on, hallelujah. I cut my hand. I know I got to go. Hallelujah. Praise God, a knife went right through my hand. Put a hole in it. And I, and I went from, I'm going to tell you, I went from spiritual to natural. I said, oh God, the blood. Jesus, the blood. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Jesus. But oh God, what, what am I going to do? What am I going to do? Remember the water. Remember the water. Oh God. Yeah, God. But yeah, but do you see all this blood? Hallelujah, I got a hole in my finger. Uh, yeah, hallelujah. Praise God. After a while, I couldn't even go back to the natural. Our pastor said, if you keep practicing the presence, keep practicing the presence, keep practicing the presence, you'll be there. Hallelujah. You got to practice no more. It's just of what we do. It's just how we live. It's just how we move. It's just how we talk. I know somebody worrying about the hole in my hand, but I put some anointing on my sister. Hallelujah. Praise God. I practice what was down on the inside of me. I took some more and I laid it. I said, Lord, that's a hole. Hallelujah. Praise God. And I, and I, and I laid hands on it and I pulled all on it. I was still crying a little bit. But I was I was still over here. I the divine. But the divine would take over. Hallelujah. And praise God. I got up the next day. How to skin back together. I tried, I, I took the band-aids off this morning. You ever been delivered and trying to see if it's still there? Did that make any sense? No. Hallelujah. But that's what it did. Hallelujah. And I looked at it. I said, ain't no hole. Come on here. Come on here. This is about the power of God. Hallelujah. Behold, I do a new thing. That was new for me. And I said, why are you going to cut me just when I got to go and do something? Why are you on the way? Well, first of all, you held the knife wrong. Hallelujah. That was my fault. <laughs> Hallelujah. Praise God. But God is good, y'all. Give God a praise. Amen. To God through the glory. Come on, somebody ought to shout about it. Come on, shout about it. Come on, shout to the King of Kings. Come on, shout to the Lord of Lords. Come on, you got to do better than that. This ain't no performance. Uh-uh, this ain't no show. Come on here. God called us together for a reason this morning. For a purpose. It's just not for anything. Don't miss God dealing with the ordinary. Don't miss him dealing with the natural. Oh, it's time to go to another prayer bell, huh? Oh, and come in and someone will still miss God. Shame on us. He said, Behold, I do a new thing. Thank God. We, I don't know if we're on Facebook or whatever, but we thank God for those that are listening. Amen. Those that are here, you may need a savior. Praise God. I, I give the invitation. Praise God. Come. Come and dine with us. Praise God through repentance of heart. Come. Hallelujah. Pray, come where the feast of the Lord is going on. Praise I come and receive him into your heart. Yes, your heart is broken, but receive God because he's a heart fixer. Yes, he is. And he's a man. I know what I'm talking about. Hey, I was a suicide victim one time, but oh, he's a heart fixer and he's a mind regulator. Won't you come? Won't you come to Christ? Amen. Thank <laughs> you.